What's up guys? Welcome back, man. Thanks for taking the time to spend a little time with me. I always appreciate that. And as you may be able to tell, look at who Mason Ryan got drafted by, guys. Who do you think it is? Is it the Pelicans? Is it the Lakers? Who do you think? But yes, he got drafted. And it is with the Lake Show, guys. He got drafted to the Lake Show. Lonzo Ball actually got drafted to the Celtics. Oh, so screen. it's going to be on Mason Ryan, man, to try to be, you know, run the show the way he wants to. You know, he's definitely wanting to be a point forward. And I believe this is going to allow him to do that without having Lonzo Ball. And, you know, we got other guys on the team here who are capable. But, yeah, you know, Mason Ryan is definitely going to try to work his way into that as he takes a deep shot. May have been an ill-advised three-pointer right there. You know, he's a little overzealous, you know, trying to get his feet wet. Just got in the game. But he needs to be careful. He definitely needs to be careful because he could get yanked right out of the game by coming in and taking, you know, an ill-advised three-pointer. Even though it was semi-open, you know, he's just trying to get, get the nerves going, you know, get the little rust off or get the jitters out of his stomach, whatever you want to call it. So let's see if he can settle down. So here he is, guys, trying to get in position. And this is one thing I actually like about NBA Live, you know, how they show you where you need to be. And look, he rides to the rack and boom! Just like that, drives to the rack, and Mason Ryan is able to get the first dunk of the game. But yeah, what I was saying, guys, what I like about NBA Live, man, is I like how they show you where to be on the play. And, and perhaps, you know, they do that as well in my career in NBA 2K. I know when I was playing my career, you know, in years past, they didn't do that. Oh, <laughs> look at that, wait a minute. That's a great way to use your head, young man, and he gets another dunk. <laughs> Did you see that? That was crazy. But yeah, back to what I was saying about 2K, man. Um, I know when I was playing my career, you know, my player, what have you, they didn't have, uh, didn't have that turned on, and maybe I just didn't cut it on, so I don't want to say that it's not there. But either way, like I said, it's something that I noticed immediately with NBA Live, so I definitely like that. You know, so I can at least, you know, run the plays that they're asking for me to run. And then, you know, if I want to try to take over, I can. So that's cool. So here we are, guys. The Lakers are uh, up 21 to 17. Mason Ryan shoots the jumper over the defender. And a quick six points just like that. Three for four. Doing pretty good as they end the first quarter. All right, so yeah, man, just take a look at some of these highlights here. You know, pushing off, getting to the cup. Beautiful stuff right there. And look at Jordan Clarkson doing his thing. Yam! Dunks all over his man. Beautiful stuff, man. They got a nice little team right here, man. Look at Clarkson running the point right there. Again, or running, you know, pushing the ball up court, finding Mason Ryan there for a nice dunk right there. So here they are, guys, midpoint of the second quarter. Ryan is bringing the ball up. Let's see what's going to happen here. And Julius Randle takes a quick shot. Nothing doing right there. Lakers are only up by two right now. 25 to 23. Ryan playing good defense right there. Tries not to get caught up in the screen. Wide open look right there, but they're unable to convert. Lopez comes down with the rebound. Here come the Lakers. And there's a nice drive right there by Brandon Jennings getting himself into nice position right there you know coming up with the foul and he's able to hit his free throw moving on in this third quarter here there's mason ryan again getting another bucket puts the lakers up 51 to 43 he's currently at 12 points six for ten from the field goal percentage there so you know doing fairly well doing fairly well can't really complain about that all right so let's see what's going to happen here on this defensive possession late in the third quarter Cousins for two, Booby Cousins unable to hit the bucket right there over Lopez. Here come the Lakers again, 51 to 43. Mason Ryan asking for the ball, finds the pick, finds his man down low, but he's unable to get the shot off, gets it blocked. But a good eye by Mason Ryan trying to put guys in position. You know, he's not a selfish player, man. He definitely wants to share the ball. You know, he wants to be that point forward that he inspires to be. So he's always going to look for someone out there, you know, that can make a better shot or a higher percentage shot. Takes the game over when he needs to. Here he is right here working the pick. Asking for another pick. Finds his guy down low again. Same guy. Unable to hit the shot right there. Doesn't even attempt it. I don't understand why he didn't go up with it. Forces Mason Ryan to take over and takes a tough shot as the clock winds down. Unable to hit. 
Then he gets called for the quick foul right there. So moving on through the third quarter here. Same score, 51 to 43. Lakers playing pretty good defense right here. Not allowing any open shots. Good defense right there by Ryan. Staying in position. This guy's a great shooter. They were on him. Impacted the shot very well there. And look at Brandon Jennings finding it. Three point shooter out there. Cartavius Cardwell Pope. You know, I wouldn't necessarily call him a three point shooter, but he found the three point shooter on that particular play. Nice step back three point shot. Lakers go up 54 to 43. Here goes Cousins again, working down low. Nice left hand, turnaround jumper. Uh, well, hook shot, I guess you would say, to get the bucket. 54-45, nine-point lead by the Lake Show. Brandon Jennings is working everything, moving the offense, getting them in position. Going to find Lopez. Lopez backing down, finds Mason Ryan. Mason Ryan with the pump fake. Goes in the middle end. Ah. Unable to get the bucket right there. Nice contested shot. Good drive, though. You got to give him credit for getting to the cup, but unable to get the bucket there. Oh, and he gets lost in the defensive possession right there. Good thing three-point shot was not made, but he got spun around. The young boy has got to learn how to be in better defensive position, you know. Things that he needs to work on being in the NBA now. And look at Pope. My goodness, Caldwell Pope. Going in for the killer slam right there. But here comes Rondo. Late in the fourth quarter. Two, about two minutes left. Lakers are up 71-65. Six-point lead they're holding on to. There's been quite a bit of highlights, man, in this particular game. Gotta love it. Very exciting game right here. Mason Ryan drives to the rack. Crosses over. Steps back. Finds Cardwell Pope. And Pope is going to have to take the final shot. He gets to the cup with the left hand. Beautiful stuff right there. Cartavius, Cardwell, Pope, five points on the day. That was a huge two right there. All set up by, you know, penetration and spreading the ball around by Mason Ryan. So he's being a very good contributor, you know, across the board here. Not just scoring his own points, but look at this. Look at Ray John Rondo. Rajon Rondo with the shot. 73-67. Still a six-point game. A minute and 23 seconds or so left. They got to play it smart. Ryan pumps fake. Gets in with the left hand. Beautiful take by Mason Ryan. And he has 14 points on the game. Seven for 14. 50% from the field. Can't be mad at that. Puts the Lakers up by eight. Woo! Anthony Davis trying to come over and pike it. But Brooke, Brooke Lopez says not today. And look at everyone spreading the ball around. Tough shot right there. I'm not really sure why he took that shot. Really not, <laughs> not liking the shot selection by that guy there. Sorry, I don't even know this guy's name. I'm still getting acclimated to my teammates. But I don't even know what he was thinking in that scenario. And look at this shot by Jordan Clarkson. You know, rushing the shot a bit. You got to work the clock right there. I don't understand why we <laughs> rushing the shot, man. We got an eight-point lead, but about 40 seconds left in the game. There's no need to shoot that early in the shot clock. I don't understand it. Look at this. Brooke Lopez is just being the rim protector back there. Mason Ryan gets the rebound. He's going to push it, slow it down a bit. Drives to the basket and takes the shot. I guess he's feeling it with 16 points. Again, I would tell him to slow down a little bit. You don't need to rush anything. He got the game won at that point, kind of rubbing it in. But I guess he just wanted to get his hands on right there, so I ain't going to be mad at him. So it looks like the Lake Show is definitely going to win this ball game, guys. Six seconds left in the game, and they're going to dribble it out, and they're going to get the victory. So huge win by the Lakers. Got to applaud. Mason Ryan coming in big in his first debut. Because he actually sat down in the first couple games of the season. This is his first game. Does a wonderful job, man. As you can see, you see the scoring chart right there. You don't see how he scored in terms of, you know, how well he played. Getting the nice points here. Got 16 points in the game. An assist and a rebound. Fairly good job right there, man. Can't be mad about that, so... 
that's all we got for you for this particular game, guys. You know, make sure if you enjoyed what you saw, hit that like button. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, cut on your notifications, and we'll see you in the next one. Until next time, peace.